Todd, honey, what are you doing over here? Gee, I just wanted to say goodbye to Copper. But I'm too late. Well, what did you plan to do if you ran to old Chief? Ah, Chief. I can outfox that dumb old dog any time. Todd, now hold it just one minute. Didn't you learn anything yesterday? Now you listen good, Todd, because it's either education or elimination. Now, if you're so foxy and old Chief's so dumb, then why does that hound get the fox on the run? Because he's got the hunter and the hunter's got the gun. A blam, elimination, lack of education. If you pound around with that type of hound, you'll wind up hanging on the wall. Keep your nose to the wind and you'll keep your skin, cause you won't be home when the hunter comes to call. Oh, Big Mama, I know Copper would never track me down. Well, Copper, he's my best friend. Oh, <laughs> your best friend. Now, Copper's gonna do what he's been told. Suppose to chase a little fox in an old foxhole, then along comes a hunter with a buckshot load. <laughs> Elimination. Lack of education. You better believe it, Todd. Yes, sir. -y. You mean Copper is going to be my enemy? Hey, Kent, you better step over here and take a good look. Why, why, that's awful. Those poor things. I'm sorry, Todd. Sometimes there are things no one can fix. Honey? Copper's gonna come back a trained hunting dog. A real killer. Oh no, not my friend Copper. He won't ever change. I hope you're right, Todd. And we'll keep on being friends forever. Uh, won't we, Big Mama? Darling, forever is a long, long time. And time has a way of changing things. <laughs> <laughs>